Welcome to Peppers and Glowworms. Okay, I went into the Dübberitzer Heide to find some triops uh, because apparently they live here and actually I found some right in the middle of the way. There are uh, quite a few puddles, some dried out, some not. Mm. And in this tiny rest of a puddle, uh, I didn't think uh, I would find anything, so I didn't record at first. Um, I only saw some mosquito larvae, but then I saw a triops. And there uh, are quite a few mosquito larvae, red ones and um, black ones, so there's enough food. And when I was looking into this little puddle, I actually also discovered fairy shrimps. Uh, they are also set to occur here, and I can confirm. Um, I saw them mating and some carrying eggs, but it's really hard to record uh, because of all these reflections on the surface of the water, and the water is quite murky. And I did not bring any containers uh, with me to, uh, in order not to tempt me to take some samples and take them home with me, because I already have some triops uh, that I um, uh, received recently um, that I want to grow. Um, so it would be stupid if I would collect some here from a natural reserve. Yeah. So anyway, I didn't bring any containers with me, uh, so I cannot uh, scoop them out and film them from the side in a smaller volume of water. Uh, maybe I will come back to it, but I think this little puddle will not uh, survive long in this summer. It has been quite rainy, uh, but I think for now there won't be enough rain to keep this filled up. There are uh, big ones and very small ones, so um, I guess it has been going for a while here. And you can imagine um, how those eggs are um, just taken up when a human or uh, some wild boars seem to occur here. They just uh, get into the mud and they take it along with them and it gets dropped in the next puddle and I guess all those larger puddles that I checked contain them as well and it just didn't find them because um, it's uh, they are not very obvious uh, to see and if the water volume is big enough you probably won't find them but I guess they are quite common here I checked iNaturalist and there were some reported sightings uh, just way way down the line but uh, I already found them here, just have uh, walked a few kilometers so far. Um, yeah, and in the other puddles there were more more bugs, uh, literal bugs, you know, and uh, some water beetles. And I think here are a few water beetle larvae as well, but um, not that many. And in the at the other puddles there were not as many plants in the area that was flooded. So maybe that's also a factor that affects the occurrence of the triops and the fairy shrimp. Okay. Interesting, interesting. Never saw them in the wild. But now I have. And I will uh, walk down the line and see what comes up. Nido burrito. Ah, so this is the actual Heide of the Döberitzer Heide.
für mich. Yeah, so near the site uh, where the iNaturalist sightings were, I found a, a puddle uh, with a huge amount of fairy shrimps and tadpole shrimps. But unfortunately I have to hurry now because I'm running low on battery on my phone and my phone is also my train ticket and I have to catch said train. <laughs> so, I guess I will return here. Very nice. Fairy shrimps, tadpole shrimps, first time seen in nature. I guess I kinda have taken some samples, some mud samples in my shoes. Oh well.